Hello, my homies. Once more, cat doing some killer clowns from outer space, the game. And I need to be full, full, full transparency. I did an intro and I did an outro for this video. And after the matches, I decided to scrap my intro and my outro. After I did the matches, I felt like I was being too hypercritical with my intro and with my outro. Now, there's nothing wrong with being critical with a game. You know, if a game has issues, you should definitely talk about it. But I feel like maybe I was in a bad mood or something whenever I first started playing. And I was kind of nitpicking on different stuff. The game definitely had issues whenever it came out. And it might still, you know, have some of the bugs and stuff. I didn't run into any of the bugs on this gameplay. But the last time that I played a couple of days ago, you know, I was still not able to pick some stuff up and there was people like walking around on invisible walls or something like they were just floating up in the air so you know there, there are issues with it but after i played my matches the game is fun <laughs> it's a fun game do i have complaints about it sure you know the the whole thing with the fact that you know there's no real incentive to be any particular clown or be any you know particular human pretty much the archetypes or whatever they're all just stat blocks you know i i do wish that there was a little bit more to the archetypes you know that they actually did come with the things that supposedly they were supposed to come with but in the long run i think all that does is just make the game progressively shallow and what i mean by that is like once you get to level 50 you know you you have everything that you need to play the game at level 50 you have all your clowns you have all of your human archetypes you have all your weapons you have everything else the only thing that you don't have is all of the cosmetics you know because to get the cosmetics you need to do the challenges and i'm sure there's people that you know want to grind for that stuff i that that's not a big thing for me personally which is you know fine but as far as progression in the game goes like i'm done <laughs> I, I was done progressing in this game at level 50 you know as far as getting new things that i care about and as shallow as the progression is the game itself is still fun like you know i did my matches i had a good time doing my matches and that's why i'm redoing the intro and everything i do have a tip for anybody that is wanting to grind out these challenges it only works for the clowns and you know a lot of people might already know this but as of a couple of days ago i didn't i just figured it out whenever i had a concept for a video that i was gonna work on so any of these clown challenges it doesn't matter which one let's go to the ranger so for this one kill 10 humans with the mallet uh stun humans 20 times with the mallet secondary charge attack anything in here that you need to do you can do them you know in the game whenever you're playing with other people but some of that stuff is probably pretty hard against human players. That's why if you go to private match and you set your team preference to the clown, whenever you go to ready, it will populate the map with uh, computer humans, you know, AI humans or whatever. And the humans are idiots. You know, they, they don't try to help each other. They don't try to escape. So, you know, for as long as it takes, you could just run around hunting them down and you can do whatever you need to do whatever the challenge is that you need to complete you can do it here and not only that but if you need you know some time looking around the maps and you know familiarizing yourself with the maps in particular you can do that here too and you know the humans aren't going to bother you or anything like that you can run around and like just investigate everything now the cool thing about this is any of the xp that you gather here you know for killing all the humans and all that stuff this plays like a regular match so it gives you all of the xp it gives you all of the things for the challenges that you do in here so it's just a very easy way to farm the clown challenges you know just in case you didn't know that being said let's jump into the matches that i have both of them turned out really good. I have a really good human match and I have a really good clown match. They were both a lot of fun. I don't see myself, you know, putting like 500 hours into this game or anything, but I'll be keeping my eye on it. Uh, whenever they do updates, whenever they add anything, 
I will probably definitely come back and check it out. But for right now, you know, I'm just having fun with it whenever I decide to jump on it. So yeah, enjoy the games. Yeah. Can't forget, a clown's weakness is its nose. I do have fun with it though. Maybe I'll get some of the guys together and you know just have a have a fun um game night with it. Gonna chuck me up some. Cuz I I feel like that'd be What is happening? I'm not Okay. Okay. Draw, clowns. All right. Um, we have an axe. Let's go see if the let's go see where the bridge is. See if the bridge is over here. Oh, there might be a key in there. We haven't. If we get, we have an axe. Okay, that's the. That's a shelter. We don't need the shelter. Until you get rid of that pink crap in the water. This is a gas. We can take that over there for somebody. I think we're just going to try to help people out in this one. Yeah, we can go ahead and put this in here. Good on you. Oh. Stop it. Just do some dodging. Oop, that's a dead end. That's another clown. Oh, okay, this is gonna be bad. <laughs> got stunned where am I right now oh shit that's a bullshit No problem. I am very hurt. All right. We have two different flares going off over here. We still have the gas can over there. I would love a hamburger. The bridge is gone. It looks like somebody just ran across the bridge because there's only one person. No, maybe two people got across the bridge. This isn't good. I am very hurt. Get him away with a gun. They're teleporting on me. They're breaking through that door.
Come back around to the front. Hopefully get away from them. Oh, thank you for the hamburger. You have a dog. There's another clown right there. Did he see me? This is actually a pretty fun match right now. <laughs> I I did all that complaining and I'm actually having a good time in this one. Okay. I know where the boat is. I know where the... Oh, I know where the boat is. Somebody just got the boat going. Don't leave. I'm coming. You get by right there? You get by right there. They have the boat ready to go. They just left on the boat. Fuck. All right. So I need a key card. I wonder if anybody left a key card at the boat. They left nothing at the boat. Okay. Uh, we could go try to put the gas back in again. I got interrupted doing that last time. Somewhere over here. Might be able to save that guy. Oh, there's another guy right there. I'm coming to help. Uh, it looks like they took my gas can to the boat. You just let that lackey jump on you. Ah, shit, there's two of them. Ah, that stun's gonna fuck me. Damn it. Boo. I saw the... He, like, teleported as a pizza. <laughs> like, I saw the teleportation lines, and then I saw the pizza run up and stun me. And the, the pizza stun got me killed. I was doing a lot of things in that one. Alright, everybody's dead on that one. Honestly, it looks like the console players are keeping this game alive. I'm the only person playing on PC. Everybody else was PlayStation and Xbox. I mean, that's kind of how TCM is right now, too. It's like a lot of console players. Pretty interesting. That was like... 
Literally, I'm the only PC playing <laughs> right now. I see somebody in there. Come to the clown, please. Where did he go? To, to stab my nose with. I was a little too overzealous on that one. I was pretty sure that she didn't have anything to pop me with, but apparently I wasn't expecting the second guy. Man, these guys are getting cocoons. Which is, I mean, the lackeys, once you know how to deal with them, they're like, they're a nuisance, like definitely. Like if you're trying to hide, I do not recommend the, the blaster. Ooh, they downed each other. It's space bar, my friend. Oh, there's somebody here. Oh, how do I get out of this? We don't need cotton candy. We'll just kill people. Narrow down their numbers a little bit. We'll narrow down their numbers and then, uh, how does that look like that? <laughs> Get pink. After we narrow down their numbers, then we can start, uh, cocooning them. Get my health back. Is he chasing somebody over here? Or is he just shooting stuff for fun? I don't know, actually. He might just be shooting shit. Oh, nope, there's something going on over here. There's definitely things happening. They broke out those windows right there. Ooh, bunk on a human. Oh shit. Oh shit, there's a lot of him. I did not know I was going into a human ambush. All right, so there's three humans right there. That's good to know. Ooh, did they just wipe us? Yeah, get him, kill him. Oh, you can't watch the clown -tality? Either that or they killed him? Yeah, you can't see the clown tally. Okay. That's interesting. I didn't know that. These humans are doing good. I don't know if they have any escapes. I didn't see anybody, any of the escape messages. Oh, hi. Guys, just, just spot me right on you. That was a great 
That was a great cotton candy fail. So cotton candy and people, whenever there's still a lot of humans, the reason it's not great is because it basically gives the humans a free chance to get a rescue. It just killed a clown out here and I don't know how to get out there. Who killed my clown brother? Yeah, see, I think they already rescued her. And like, what's the point of, uh, what's the point of giving them a free, an extra chance, you know? Oh, they're, they're resurrecting everybody. Where'd he go? Hmm. They were trying to resurrect everybody. We stopped them though. No, the air horn. Ooh, fucking stunned the shit out of her. Did she... I think that... I think that other chick quit. Man, they are just... They're just... They're just fighting. I mean, if you have a group of humans and you have a group of clowns, the clowns should win. Especially if they have, like, their power-ups and stuff. There's somebody over here. I was trying to change my clown -tality. I didn't want to do the pie one again. They almost, they almost got everything. They almost did, uh, we got these boys just hanging out. They almost brought everybody back. No, oh, one of our... Is he shooting at somebody? He's just breaking doors. That guy has a dog. Follow the guy with the dog. He doesn't look to be very accurate with his dog, unfortunately. Can we find somebody? We're just, we're just swinging at leaves. Oh shit, I, I actually hit him. <laughs> I was like, we're just swinging at leaves over here. I actually fucking hit him. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking funny. I did not hit that stop sign. That stop sign came out of nowhere. I 
that's some doo doo butter right there. What's the teleportation thing? I hate that the map spins. It's like disorienting. Where the hell is the teleporter? Not the teleporter, the resurrection machine. These boys are just stuck here, but I mean, honestly, them camping that is a good thing. ran into the spread of that? That's some BS. You. I was patrolling the area. That was a good game. He must have ran up here and like I just didn't see him. Either that or he was hiding in one of those bushes. Those were some good rounds. I had fun on both those rounds. That, that, that was a fun human round and that was a fun clown round. Going back out. And that's going to be it for this one. Like I said, I had a really good time on both of those matches. It, it literally made me change my intro and the outro to this video, which I don't do very often. Every once in a while, I'll go back and be like, okay, well, you know, I'd rather do this or I'd rather say that. Yeah, just to reiterate, the gameplay is fun. The, the gameplay loop is fun. The progression and the bugs, which I didn't run into in these two games, you know, those are my biggest issues with this game. And compared to the issues of a lot of other games that are out right now, these aren't that huge. But overall, let me know what you think. Uh, are you still playing Killer Clowns? Did you stop playing Killer Clowns? Did you never play Killer Clowns? <laughs> Maybe you just enjoy watching it. You know, that's a complete possibility. Either way, though, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Hopefully I see you in another one of my videos and we you.